Hey, welcome back guys, this is Crafty Fox, and today I'm going to be showing you how to build some Indonesian stainless steel executive class coaches. Now I have two of them right over here. This one is the newer version, and right over here these are the older versions. Now they're both redesigns of the original executive class coach that I made, and since I redesigned the CC203 and CC206, I also had to redesign the coaches to match up with it. And uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoy the new design. It is a slab taller than the older model. And yeah, let's get started on the build. So first we're going to do, we're to take out uh, gray concrete. And we're to place that two blocks above our narrow gauge tracks. And I'm going to make it 31 blocks long. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 1, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31. And then we're going to extend the back all the way across. And both locomotive, I mean, both coaches will use the same exact bases. Okay, so now we're going to go to this edge here and add upside down another brick stairs, back to back. And then a 2x2 two two of another brick wall. Then two nether brick slabs on top. And let's go on the other side and repeat the same thing over here. Just back to back, nether brick stairs, two by two walls, and then two slabs on top. Now we're going to add in the wheels. So let's go down here and we're going to skip these three gray concretes. And we're going to add a pair of gray concretes in the middle. That's going to be our wheel. Then we'll add in um, upside down nether brick stairs right behind it right side upstairs and then another upside down and then a pair of gray concretes for the other wheel and do the same thing on the other side and then we'll add dark oak buns sides of the wheels and in the middle will be a dark oak fence gate and we're going to open that up same thing on the other side and we're going to go to the other end and just do the same thing so skip these three Add a pair of wheels here, and then add another brick stairs, upside down, and then right side up, upside down, and then another pair of wheels here, and do the same thing over here. I'm going to add buttons to the sides of the wheels, and fence gate in the middle, open them up. So it should look like this. Alright, then in the middle on the bottom, we're going to take out stone brick slab. I'm going to skip one away from this wheel. Add a 2x2, two two. skip 1, add 2, skip 1, add a 2x3, skip 1, add 2, skip 1, add a 2x2. Two two. So it should look like this, and yeah, that is pretty much it for uh, the basis of it. Now we're going to converge it into whichever version we want. Alright, so now we're going to build this version. So what we're going to do, let's go on top, add in 4 blocks wide of polyt polish in a site like that and we're going to extend this all the way across to the other side so pretty much fill in the entire roof area so once you filled in the roof it should look like this then we're going to go right to the edge here and we're going to add in uh, four blocks wide polish in a site two blocks tall across like that and then we'll do the same thing on the other side And this coach is actually uh, symmetrical, so I'm just going to show you how to build uh, one side and you just copy the same thing on the other side. So I'm going to do this side. Let's place uh, upside down uh, polish and side stairs right here facing inwards. Right side up stairs here. And then three polish and sites. Then on top row, we're going to add three polish and sites. And then we'll add a black stained glass block here and then two polish anisites. Next we'll go on the other side add upside down uh, polish anisite stairs right there then we're going to add a right side up polish anisite stairs then two polish anisites top row we're going to add three polish anisites black glass here two polish anisites now we're going to add in uh, black glass, every other block right over here. So go over here, just go across, 
every other block and then we're going to fill in the spaces in between with black concrete. So get our black concrete, fill in the spaces in between, all the way across, like that. And then we're going to go on the inside part and add in black concrete behind each of the windows. So they are blacked out unless you're doing some sort of interior, which would be quite small. So it should look like this. And then we'll add in uh, this uh, cyan terracotta, three blocks long right here. Go to the other end, add polish uh, and a cyan side, and then three cyan terracottas like that. Then we're going to delete these four uh, blocks here and replace them with orange concrete. Add it along like so. Go to the other side. In a part, add four orange concretes like that. Alright, then we're going to go in and add uh, orange concrete all the way across the top section like that and we'll take out stone brick slab and I'm going to add four here and then we'll go on the other side and add stone brick slab four on the bottom then we'll add polish in a site all the way across the bottom row alright and then we're going to go to this uh, middle area you see like this bottom box just go right above it line it up Add a stone brick slab right here, make a V shape like that, and we'll add in a dark oak sign right above it, like so. Then we're going to take out stone brick slab, and we're going to make this upper slab go all the way across to the other end like that, and the other side just go all the way across, same thing. Across like that. Then we'll take out iron bars, go to the side of this door, add a pair. Like that, same thing on the other side, pair. And the bottom portion will add in uh, spruce trap doors, spaced apart with dark oak uh, trap door in the middle. Do the same thing in the other side. So it should look like this. Then we'll take out a spruce button and this top corner, dark oak sign here, birch button next to it on the other side spruce button the top corner and acacia button right here uh, birch button here acacia button underneath and now on the outer portion there's going to be this acacia fence so let's add that right there same thing on the other side then we're going to take dark oak sign go in the middle add one in the bottom row make it two blocks long then add birch signs to either side of it and dark oak sign to the left hand side of that. Alright, so once we finish this off, we're going to flip it off to the other side. Alright, so once we have both sides, uh, we're going to go on the roof and just skip one block away and add a 2x3 of polished anisite slab. Go on the other side, do the same thing, just skip a block, 2x3 of polished anisite slab. Then we're going to go in the middle, add two blocks wide, polished anisite slab, and we're going to add three in the front and then three in the back and one last thing we're going to add birch buttons right at the end of this car and do that on both sides like that and yeah that is how you build the executive class coach now I'm going to show you how to build this older version of it so to get started on that we're going to take a lapzuli add four blocks wide right here and then add a two by two of smooth quartz on top Go to the other end and do the same thing. And make it two blocks tall. Alright, cool. So now we're going to do like uh, one part, one side at a time because the other side same exact thing. So for this side, we're going to take Lapsuli, add two of them right over here. And then we'll go to the other side, add two more Lapsuli like that. Then we'll add black glass block inside here, a lapis on the inner part of it, and then the upper quartz slab in front of it, 
then a 2x2 two two of smooth quartz. Then we'll add a pair of iron bars along the side like that. Go on the other side, do the same thing. So let's add in the black glass right here. Lapsuli dangling behind a uh, quartz slab here and then a 2x2 two two of smooth quartz. And then we're going to line up the sides all the way across with the smooth quartz. Cross like that. Then we'll take out black glass and we're going to add it right over here every other block to reach the other side. Now the window pillars for this one is going to be gray instead of black. So take out uh, gray concrete then add it in between where the windows are and then we'll add black glass or I mean black concrete on the inside part. So take uh, black concrete, go inside the window and add it so the windows are all blacked out. So it should look like this. Then we're going to take out uh, orange concrete and we're going to add one here. Then go diagonally down, add three, go up, two, down, one, skip this one, and then add two on top. And then three down. Then we're going to go to this edge here and add an upside down smooth quartz stairs facing inwards. And then quartz, smooth quartz in front of it and then fill in all the spaces in between the orange. And go to the other side, add upside down smooth quartz stairs right there. And then smooth quartz all the way across to where the orange are. Like so. Now the inner part of this, it's going to be uh, lapsuli all the way across so that we have that nice blue stripe. Alright. And then we'll add in smooth quartz uh, slab uh, right above it in front like that all the way across like so. Then we'll add in iron bars here. Apparently I forgot to add that. And then we'll go to the second window pillar. Delete this block and replace it with smooth quartz. Add a uh, acacia button to the side of it. Then we'll add dark oak sign next to this window. Birch button next to it. And go here in the middle. It'll line it up with this uh, three block wide. Go up. Add dark oak sign in the middle. Then we're going to line up with this hole here, add dark oak sign, birch sign, dark oak sign, dark oak sign, and then birch sign. Then we'll move on to the other side, add acacia button on top here, definitely down, add a birch button like that. Then on the bottom part, we're going to add in these two iron trap doors with dark oak trap door in the middle. Same thing on the other side. And on the roof part, uh, that's going to be uh, different for each side. So uh, this side, it's going to be polished uh, diorite slab, then smooth quartz slab, polished diorite slab, and then three smooth quartz. And then three iron trap doors on the side of that. On the other side, it's going to be polished diorite slab, and then two smooth quartz, and then three uh, stone smooth stone slabs and then iron trap doors the side of it and then smooth quartz slabs all the way across and link it up to the other side all right so it should look like this and then we're also going to add in a uh, dark oak uh, button to the end of it right there and same thing on the other side like so now we're going to flip it off to the other side. So once you have both sides, that's pretty much it on how to build both versions of the executive class coach in Minecraft. I hope you guys enjoy the video. If you do, remember to hit that like button down below because it helps the channel. And if you haven't already, please subscribe because I'll be uploading more videos like this in the future. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.